is a nice little feature. Anyway, what to do with it do, guys? Today won't be any GVG because the guild that we got put against are like Lobby <laughs> or they quit. I don't know, but they're all around 40 to 50. And I just, I just felt bad if we try to uh, fight them or post a video about it. You know, I usually post guilds that have a chance of fighting back. If they're all 60, then. Yeah, we'll, 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 we'll make a video about it, but other than that, we'll just uh, we'll just leave them alone. So here's a random video about my Waver 11 team. Now, my Waver 11 team, I just got together just now. Actually, I've been, I, I been at a Waver 11 team, but the thing is, I just six-starred Seaside Bologna, and I was farming, I was getting her to 60 with Sigurd and Angelic Mottmo. Now, these two has been my general uh, Waver 11 runners forever since the start of this account actually <laughs> it feels bad that i don't have her i don't have montmorency gear actually fully leveled up but her healing and her uh her s2 and her s3s it's fully maxed out except for her s1 it feels bad but this is my gear for my Mo. now she's wearing she's rocking the effect resistance boots and necklace because when I was farming Ben, she, she, that's all, that's all I could get, honestly. And unfortunately, that, uh, the fact, the fact resist kind of trolled me, by the way. Because I kind of wanted the uh, effect resistance for the boots. But again, it was like, you know what? I'm going to hook you up with some crit chance. And that's what exactly they did, too. And same with the necklace. <laughs> I, I wanted speed or effect resistance. And it was like, you know what? We're going to hook you up with some of that crit chance. <laughs> it's like, game, please. Other than that, everything has some kind of sort of effect resistance to reach a hundred, at least a hundred effect resistance. And I'm pretty sure she's fully the. Uh, I don't think she's fully the uh, skill in her skill tree. Yeah, she's 27. I think the thing I'm missing is the the sleepy her S1 the chance. Yeah, this is for PVP, and I'm like, I'm not gonna do that. What's that like extra 40 uh, runes? I was like, yeah, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> I need those rooms. I have two. I have two triangle rooms and two epic rooms, so I'm not gonna do that. The other person is Secret. Now her gear hasn't changed. She's been an attack crit for like forever. She has good attack, by the way, with 3,800, and her helmet is still not fully maxed out. I could probably get a better helmet than this, actually. I could probably get a better helmet than this if I farm. Uh, if I farm Golem, but the thing is. Kind of like that speed being at 173, but it's not helping her since she's squishy. But if I get a different helmet, then she'll definitely be a okay for the most part. Where she could probably take names and do stuff like this. And what is this necklace? <laughs> what is this necklace? And just rolled on a crit chance, 30% crit chance. That's not bad actually. I think everything rolled like 3%, and then the crit. I think everything did roll 3%, and it just rolled twice. Hmm. Defense a quick chance to her damage. Well, yeah, that's my secret. So, your yeah, Mumbo and Secret has been in the Wavering 11 forever. And here's my Seaside Bologna. I was like, if you can't beat them, join them, right? Now, her gear is not the best. I'm only using this because I was farming side story and I needed somebody to hold it while I was leveling her up. Leveling leveling her up. And I just thought that she could probably use it because it's for anybody. I'm probably gonna use uh Ringer Special Drink. Would I actually get her gear or Rosa Garner? I'm pretty sure Rosa Garner because it's fully maxed out, but I don't have the stuff to actually equip our artifact. For the most part, I'm just farming waving to look for a different necklace than this. Maybe an HP necklace would be fine, actually. Let me let me scroll down for a bit for like it's the only HP next I can think of. That will go fine with this. Actually, this doesn't seem bad actually. Hmm. That's my boost or attack and this is affecting this. I didn't want to have some bulk. I did I kinda of do want to be bulky. That fifty that fifty cents crit chance is uh look at staring me in the face. So there's a lot of improvement. What you guys think? Try 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 to aim for it. Try try for aim for a crit necklace? That will give me around, I think, 55%. I don't know, yeah, 55% max. For for it to be crit cap, or should I try just for HP? I think I'll just try to look for a crit chance main stat necklace with some HP in it. Because everything else has crit damage. <laughs> Except for that one. This is, like, bulky. 
And it says crit damage, rolling all the crit damage. Yeah. Huh. I don't know. I'm still working on C side below the and then her twenty five hundred attack will be I think I think it will just touch twenty seven when I actually get the tenth fuse nerves and I actually get some epic catalyst, which will be I think Friday is for the epic runes. I think Friday is for the epic runes. The epic rune hunts. Where it's like the runes are doubled for this event, so that's when I would be probably farming for them. But other than that, yeah, so we got a Bologna. For the most part, since I'm able to, like, like with these three, I'm able to actually do a three-man wavering, which is pretty nice because I have all these extra dogs and I can make another six-star. I, I, actually, I never actually tried a three-man wavering before. That's weird, even though I have all these uh, ice units up here. Clarissa, Lulica, I think that's it. Yuna, Dizzy. I never actually tried to do a, a three-man waver 11 till now. And it's pretty nice that they actually threw three man waver and eleven with uh with some kind of fodder because you got all these little dogs. But the thing is, I can't make enough six stars to actually, <laughs> you know, pop them out like that because I only have 188 gold. Even during this event, I've been farming all day and have like 12 leaves, and I still don't have no gold to show for it. So we're gonna do a quick waver and eleven so you guys can see some of my uh, proudness. Alright, so the most part for the Wave at 11 with this team, I could pretty much still fail. It's like... Well, I think that the only time I failed was when I had a yellow dog, because, you know, since it's not an ice unit, the Waver get CR boost, and Secret and uh, Beep Below is not that fast to actually keep up with the, the speed boost, especially Mamo. Also, if Mamo used both her heals at the very beginning, like on the fodder things, then she end up not having heals for herself. <laughs> So that also could be a problem. Is your end. But usually, Secret tries to end it, and Bologna lands a defense break and whatnot. And if not, oh, that's it's good. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't think she'll get another defense break. Yeah, she'll get another defense. If if she get a, a defense break, don't get crit twice. Don't get crit. Yeah, crit. Defense break. Oh, that's good. And Sigrid should just kill this thing, so that's my three man waving 11. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna go farm some more hunts. I think the next hunt I probably will do after wavering, if I find one piece of good usable necklace, which might take me half a year, is gonna be a uh, golem. I think I'll, I'll probably fix up my Gunther, honestly. Because Gunther needs it. <laughs> Hope you guys see you around. Hope you guys enjoy. See you guys around. Wow. Peace.